of every reincarnation. I've always believed in reincarnation, partly because it just intuitively felt right, and partly because of a number of memories that are as though they have always been there. This feeling intuition for the reality of death and rebirth, along with an exposure to Buddhist and Hindu scripture at a young age, led to the formation of a mental perceptual model of reincarnation very much in line with classical Buddhist ideas that feature the concept of a soul which reincarnates through a series of lifetimes according to its attractions and aversions until desiring and eventually attaining enlightenment and freeing themselves from the pain of constant rebirth. I don't think anymore that it's like this. I think there's far more going on than that. And I think consciousness is orthogonal to perception. What do I mean by that? I mean that even the concept of the linearly evolving multi-life being is illusory. This is because the entire concept is immediately recognized as a wholly imaginary construct when perceived from the perspective of what you actually are as boundless non-separate awareness. There is no me, I am an illusion. There is no you, you are me. We only think we are separate beings through a trick of refraction. We have lived every life, together, forever, already. Your past lives are my past lives because we aren't separate consciousness. And everything has already occurred and will occur. This means that there is no bondage, no karma, no past lives. No limitation, no restriction, no beginnings or endings, no separation, no distance, no place devoid of consciousness. All of these things are concepts created from the position of self-identification and are only real from that position. It also means that it's not only possible to remember something that might be your past life, but mine as well, since in reality we have lived them all already, together. There is no real limitation or seriousness to any of it, and we are already free and always have been.